Hello and welcome back to another op amp circuit analysis. Today we are going to review this inverting amplifier and determine the circuit voltage gain VO to VI in decibel, where VI is a sinusoidal signal at frequency of 1 kHz. A quick reminder about the circuit elements here. The capacitor C is in microfarad and micro is 10 to the power of minus 6. The inductor L is in milli Henry and milli is 10 to the power of minus 3. And frequency is in kilohertz and kilo is 10 to the power of 3. Now back to the circuit. As you may recall, the voltage gain of an inverting op amp amplifier is the feedback resistor divided by the input resistor. However, here in our circuit, we have an element such as a capacitor and inductor which they don't have a real resistance. Instead, they have a unique reactance value at every frequency. So to find the circuit voltage gain, we will need to calculate the capacitive reactance and inductive reactance for given elements at frequency of 1 kHz. The reactance of capacitors and inductors also called impedance in electrical engineering and they are imaginary values. As you can see here in the bottom circuit, I replaced the capacitor C with impedance Z1 and replaced the resistor R and inductor L with impedance Z2. Let me write the voltage gain VO to VI formula with the impedance Z1 and Z2. So first we will need to determine the impedance value of Z1 and Z2, then calculate their absolute values or magnitudes. As you can see here, Z1 is only consists of capacitor C. So let's find its reactance at frequency of 1 kHz. Also remember the capacitive reactance is a negative imaginary component and inductive reactance is a positive imaginary component and their units is ohm. In the electrical engineering we use minus J for capacitive reactance and J for inductive reactance. Let's plug the given capacitance and frequency values in the expression and calculate the capacitive reactance. So the impedance will be and its magnitude value is Before we continue, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Your support will help this channel to grow and encourage me to create more content. Thank you and now back to the video. For impedance Z2 we have
where XL is and by plugging the inductor and frequency values we will get So impedance Z2 will be From algebra we know that the absolute value or magnitude of a complex numbers such as a Z2 will be Now we can plug Z2 and Z1 in the circuit voltage gain formula. And finally, the voltage gain in decibel is defined by I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I also have other videos in reviewing op-amp in RLC circuits, which I will put the links under the video description.